we're here tonight because we're celebrating the imminent launch of AirSat-1, which is Ireland's first satellite. It'll be the first time that Ireland has independently built and launched a satellite into space. It's a launch for a launch. You've got a huge amount of students, staff, I suppose expertise coming together to create something I actually want to call a national treasure. It's a real moment for us and to celebrate something really positive that can have an impact not only now, but way into the future and have a real legacy is amazing. So that's what we're celebrating. Tonight's event is really, really exciting. It's really good to see how far the project has come. Before we even get to the launch pad, we've accomplished about 90% of our learning goals. So it's a really good stage to get to. We've already met our learning goals. We're already happy that we can do this again. We're going to be the ones in charge communicating with the satellite. So every day we're going to need to sit down in front of the computer and send commands to the satellite about what data or what we want the satellite to do or what data we want to get from the satellite. And the satellite talks back to us in beeps and boops and will hopefully successfully give us all the data that we want. Uh, all has been done by uh, the University uh, College uh, uh, Dublin STEAM. Uh, we gave access uh, to uh, test facilities to the students. Uh, we accompanied them uh, during, the, during the, the test phases, etc. And then lately, uh, we also supported uh, Ireland uh, to become a spacefaring nation by adopting a space law. So we are extremely proud at uh, the European Space Agency, and in particular at the, the uh, Education Office, to have contributed uh, to this uh, a historic, uh, historic uh, moment, and uh, we wish the best of, uh, of luck for the uh, upcoming operations to the team. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, it's just brilliant to see how well everything went with the launch. I mean, it was just, just perfect, like clockwork. It's almost like they engineered it, <laughs> which of course they did. Absolutely ecstatic. We can't wait. I, I, I can speak for the rest of the team where we can't wait to actually talk to the satellite and look in the following months and see what kind of science it's going to produce. Uh, we've just got confirmation that AirSat's launched. This is so exciting because we know it's out there, it's in space. Uh, we're just waiting on communications to make sure it's all safe and healthy. So we'll take it very slowly from here, step by step, and just take it nice and chill and make sure everything's okay. This is a very proud and historic moment for Ireland and for UCD. The notion that a satellite which was imagined and designed and built here in UCD is now in space is an absolutely wonderful achievement and we are so delighted with the success. Look, 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 tonight is a celebration of the work, but it's also a celebration of the impact. The impact is not only just uh, what the work that's been done, but the people and the expertise that they've learned and where they'll go from that. It can show that Ireland is a centre of excellence, not only in terms of space technology, but just technology research and education in general, and a real celebration of the people and why companies come here. We in UCD are now working with industry, with government, with agencies around the development of a really, really thriving space sector for Ireland. We see so much potential here. We're working very positively towards it. And this is the first step in that very, very important journey.